So, so far I would actually say that this is my favorite waterfall. I would say that probably, at least for us, was not worth it. <laughs> Good morning guys, welcome back. It's about 8 o'clock here in Oslo. As you can see behind me, it's ridiculously lively here. So many cars, so many people around in the morning. When we arrived yesterday, it was pretty much empty here. I mean, we came in the afternoon, not too late, but it's absolutely dead. And it was really, really quiet, really calm vibe. Right now, it's so, so completely different. I guess because of the whale watching in the morning, so many people come from the city center, come from different towns just to watch this. And this way it's like, it's ridiculously, ridiculously loud here. And ridiculously lively here, I'm sorry. So actually, we are done with the whale watching as you saw in the previous vlog. Now we're gonna head to Simolon Island, which is a small sandbank off the coast here. But first on the agenda, we have to get some water because we have nothing left. We're thirsty. Honey, wow, crazy. Despacito, come on. Oh, yeah. Fancy. Yeah. That was good, it's good, it's good. Awesome, man. Water for the young lady. How much is it? Water for the old guy. Old? <laughs> you! <laughs> how much is, I don't know how much it is actually. No, it's like 25, isn't it? Yeah. Without water, life is hot. Dry, dry. It's yeah. dry. Oh, <laughs> clever one. Clever one, Julia. Thank you. I ah, kind of failed there, guys. I'm so sorry. Ooh, do they have the Norwegian flag? Can't see it. Filipino, British. Is this Colombia? Maybe Colombia? Russian, okay. Japanese, okay. Egypt maybe? Uh, doesn't seem like anything. No German, no Norwegian. Good job. Okay, we made it back. We got ourselves some water and now we're ready to go. At least ish, we need to pack, but this is quick. Our only problem is that our host, who actually booked the whole tour for us, is not here now, so... We're trying to find her now. Alright, we're gonna try to go look for her in her own restaurant. That seems like a good place to start. We don't really know her real name, which makes it all a little bit harder, but from, for now we're just gonna call her Mother Teresa. Maybe it's actually correct. Who knows? I think she's actually there. Oh, she's there. She's there. there she is. So, yeah, they already sorted it. So, there's a person that was gonna take us to the pier. We're just gonna go pack our bags really quick and then we're heading out, so let's go. All right, I think this is our boat. It's basically just a big version of the typical Filipino fisher boats. In general, I really dig the way the Filipinos build their boats. Kind of feels like you're on a sailboat all the time. It's pretty cool. It doesn't seem to be, maybe we're only like 10 people. That would be amazing. We'll see. I think I gotta clean you guys. Better? Hope so. This is what we would call a handmade handrail. and I actually think that we're not allowed to go on the island because we didn't pay okay so guys we're gonna have to stick to this area oh. you see him waving good mood over there this is a sandbank I think everywhere where the water is like super super blue super bright it's quite for you as you can see but there's space for everyone <laughs> They have a whale, how cool is this? I want a whale as well, but yeah, we don't have one. All right. 
Alright guys, we made it back from Simulan Island now. It's only like 11 o'clock in the morning, so we have so much time. See you a little bit later, we're gonna go to check out the Tumalog Falls. It's really not that far from here. Uh, we heard so many great things about it. It's apparently like a really, really cool waterfall in, uh, in Cebu. And if you guys have followed our channel, you guys know that we love waterfalls. We checked out so many of them already. We're looking forward to this one. We're just gonna head back to the hotel first. Maybe have like a 10, 15 minutes break. Get some coffee maybe and then be on our way. First time we're trying Kopiku coffee. Really nice brand. I like this instant coffee, it's really good. Me too, I like it as well. And I actually don't like every coffee. I don't like it when it's too dark or without sugar or without milk. One, probably like one year ago, Julia had like never drank coffee, not at all. Not a single cup, she never wanted anything. But look what I did, guys. I turned it into a coffee machine. He made me an addict. <laughs> I know. And a coffee machine. She came to Norway, she realized it was cold. She realized it was cozy to have a coffee. She started with a few sips of my cup. Before she knew it, she couldn't handle it without. She couldn't sleep. So not true. She was waking up at night with like shakes. You know? This is so not Just true. Like now eating I have the like coffee. one coffee in two weeks. <laughs> it's crazy. I call that addictive. <laughs> Do you think like 13 days? No. You just really tried to do math in her head now. Yeah. It's not going well. How many hours did you sleep last night? Just because I'm sick, Sandra. <laughs> exactly, exactly. No. Exactly. My ex point exactly. I'm We're gonna end it here. No, no. <laughs> a little disaffection <laughs> and a little affection. Thank you. Aww. Thank you. It's only for the love. I can't actually. Oh, I lost it. This is disgusting. I lost it, guys. Oh. <laughs> How cute am I? Do you see that it's a heart? I see that it's a heart. Yeah, why aren't you screaming and be like, Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm so cute! <laughs> Did you just eat just the syrup? The syrup I just wanted to try if I want more and then do one. Yeah, of course. Waiting for me Spirit just gazing with me Fell in love Not knowing what I will not give you up this time. <laughs> this way. Darling, just kiss me slow. Your heart is all I own. That was amazing. Thank you, sir. That was amazing. You have talent. <laughs> this is going on YouTube, so you're gonna you're gonna be a star. Maybe star. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> so we just got ourselves a little private concert there. That guy was so good at singing and yeah, he loved Ed Sheeran. So we found ourselves a scooter now. We pay 100 pesos per person. So they let us off now at the top of the... We drove quite high up. It's like at the top of a really high mountain here. It's a little, it's a little small little market there with a the parking, parking area. It's a little awesome. It's a little awesome. It's a little awesome. There was some good views on the way. The sun is shining. We're gonna go check it out now. Um, anything else you wanna add? I'm looking forward. I'm looking back home. It's a horrible joke. Horrible joke, guys. Alright, let's go. Say something nice to the viewers. We love you. Aww. It's true, though. We're at the waterfalls now, we can see it is like 50 minutes over, 50 meters over there. So we're just gonna head there now, pay the entrance tickets. Looks pretty awesome, I would it's say. really nice, let's be honest here. I think what is nice is that it's like, not that strong, but it's more like those... It kind of seems like it's constantly raining over there. And there's these like nice pools all the way actually. I honestly think it looks really beautiful. Yeah. Way better than expected. We saw so many waterfalls, but I think this is one of the most beautiful waterfalls we saw so far. But we haven't been there yet, so maybe I shouldn't say this. <laughs> We're getting our brothers to pay since it's his last day with us today. <laughs> so you can pay for all of us. Entrance is 20 pesos per person. So I would say we're about 40 meters away from the waterfall now. And I can already feel the kind of like, like wet breeze coming in from the waterfall. So it's already getting a little wet. There you guys go. Here you see it. Just arrived and this is really the most beautiful waterfall I have seen so far. At least I would say this, I'm not sure if you have agreed, but so nice. There's so many layers and you can see all the layers at once and 
it looks like some music kind of like a fairy tale I would say. I don't know, I really really love it. It looks so peaceful and the waters are like super strong and really special so yeah really really beautiful. <laughs> Smooth. How is it? It's really cold. I usually are there to go in the water, so I can't be any worse. I have to get in. Generally, I'm not a big fan of getting into cold water, but it's always like a small challenge. So we're gonna do it again. I'm gonna make it. We had to deal with the driver to go back and meet him an hour after he dropped us off. So we have to walk up the steep hill now. It was actually a really beautiful waterfall, I would say. It's really nice, really picturesque. The water wasn't as cool as everyone said in the internet, so actually it was pretty nice. Definitely recommended to come here and spend maybe an hour, maybe two hours, whatever you feel like here. Maybe get some good photos. There's we, so many like picture spots actually. Definitely. It's crazy. We got some good ones, I, I would say. Uh, they will come out on Instagram, so if you guys are not following us on Instagram, make sure you do so. The link's in the bio. Uh, in, the bio? in the description. <laughs> <laughs> the link's in the description, guys. Oh yeah, so so far I would actually say that this is my favorite waterfall. I also really, really like the Twin Falls, actually, in Bohol. But, we, especially because no one else was there and there's this cool tube rings. But I think that if you just look for it, it's more beautiful. <laughs> For me, it's definitely this one. It has been a really exciting day. In general, I would say that the waterfalls actually were my highlight. Yeah. If you're in Oslo, definitely make sure you go there. I think it's super easy to do it, for example, after the way shark swimming or the Or even the evening before, because exactly. you probably want to stay here one night so that you... Yeah, I mean, you kind of have to because the whale shark watching starts so early, so you definitely want to be here the night before. So maybe you can actually go watch it in the evening. It's a really beautiful waterfall, definitely check that one out. We were actually staying here for two nights and that's probably unnecessary. It's not like that much else to do. You can also visit the Simulon Island. Simulon Island. But especially if that's like the only extra thing that you have to do. And it costs us, it set us back 500 pesos per person plus entrance fee of 20. I would say that probably, at least for us, was not worth it. And uh, the waterfall and the grey sharks are way, way better. My way, opinion. way They're better. so much fun. Both of those activities, yeah. definitely worth the visit. Whilst the island, you can definitely skip without losing out on anything. This is the best waiter around there. She's only 13 years old. She's so good. She's so good. She's uh, working at Mother Teresa restaurant. It's an awesome restaurant. They have really delicious food. I remember we said in the previous vlog that it was really far hard to find food around here. The truth is, it wasn't. Mother Teresa restaurant, amazing place. Just go there, guys. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hello. We got a visitor. <laughs> She's been taking care of our key here. Hello. She's been taking care of our key. Bam. Oh. Bam. <laughs> have, have you guys seen the jellyfish? Can you do the jellyfish? Whoop, 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 whoop. It's the jellyfish. Boom, whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> Yulia, you want to join? Singing. <laughs> she is so much better than he is. I know. Wow, this is really good. 
Das ist honestly better than I would ever do it. Yeah, thank you so much. Oh. You're the best. If you like this video, leave us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss our next videos. And yeah, the journey continues tomorrow.